Hello everyone, so today we will talk about the 2025 Nissan Altima interior part. So let's get started. The 2025 Nissan Altima where Nissan has really focused on comfortable quality and technology to enhance the driving experience. Whatever you are a short commute or a long road trip, this cabin is built to impress. The dashboard has a simple driver focused design with soft touch materials and subtle chrome accents that give it a premium feel. In front of the driver, you have got a leather warped steering wheel with integrated controls for audio, quiz and driving assistant features. Behind the wheel, there's a fully digital 12.3 inch driver display in the higher that shows all your vital driving information in a crisp and clear format. In the center, the 2025 Altima comes with a 12.3 inch touchscreen infotainment system which is standard on most trims. The interface is easy to use and features wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, making it super convenient to stay connected on the go. Below the screen, you have got physical climate control, which I appreciate for their ease of use. The gear selector is positioned neatly, freeing up space for a wireless charging pad and an additional storage compartment. The materials inside the Altima are surprisingly upscale for a mid-size sedan. Nissan offers premium leather upholstery with contrast stitching in higher trims and even the entry level models feature high quality cloth seat that's are durable and comfortable for the the use of soft touch materials extends to the door panels and armrests giving the interior a cohesive well crafted feel one of the things that makes the ultima a great daily driver is the comfort the front seats are nissan's zero gravity seats designed to reduce fatigue on long drives they are both heated and ventilated with power adjustment available on higher trims in the rear there's plenty of legroom and headroom for adult passenger making it a practical choice for families and carpooling when it comes to practical the ultima doesn't disappoint the trunk offers about 15.4 cubic feet of cargo space which is more than enough for grocery runs or weekend trips if you need extra room, the rear seats fold down in a 60 to 40 split, giving you even more flexibility for larger items. So that was the video for today and we will see you in the next video. Thank you.